Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our old craft. It has been a while, but we are picking up exactly where we left off in the last episode, which is after defeating the dragon and having a small attempt at this battle tower right here, which uh, didn't, it, I'm not fully prepared yet, which is what we're going to be doing right now. I've been taking shelter in this shelter right here, and we will be coming back to this shelter uh, specifically later on. Right now, I just need to find my way back home, but that should be a fairly straight line in this-ish direction. Mm, okay, yeah, that's a very full inventory. I think I will stop for some iron, though. Because, uh, also, I updated the pack, so there is some new stuff as well that we're going to be taking a look at. One thing that I am particularly very, very interested in. But yes, let me lower the footsteps. I think that's the one. Just so that they're not as, uh, as, uh, dominating. No, 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 no. I can't jump, can't jump, can't jump, can't jump. Okay. Okay, welcome back to our old craft, huh? I'm gonna die here. I think I'm gonna die here. I can't... I can't jump, I can't run, I can't do anything. I don't have any arrows. Okay, you're fast, you're fast. Okay, I can jump now, I can jump now. Okay, you're right behind me. Okay, that is not how I wanted to start this journey. That's a giant tree. That's a giant tree. That's a farm. Oh, it's still there. Uh, I have no... Arrows or anything. Can I hit it from here? Maybe if I remove this. Hold on. Hold on. Might be able to. Yep. Uh oh. Please don't. Just die. <sighs> Two gold ore, huh? Not how I intended on starting this episode, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, well, maybe I, d I do want the iron, though. I do really want the iron. You steal my stuff, don't you? I'm fairly sure you do. Oh, well. I'm gonna get all this iron ore, and then I'm gonna head home, get organized, and then we're gonna take a look at some stuff. Uh, and then we'll be coming back for this battle tower, because I really do want the XP in there. So, yes, let me do this, and then I will be right back. And I'm gonna keep my distance from the ore this time. Okay, I'm being hunted by something. I'm being hunted by something. Okay, I was just digging an emerald ore that was just there. I'm being attacked by this. And I'm not healed fully, properly. <laughs> hmm. Hello. Oh, no. Please. Okay, what are you? Crystal shard shard. You know what? The sun is going down. I am... <laughs> I am losing valuable time here. I need to get back home. I need to not mine any more weird ores. Where is my horse? No, sir. That is... Yeah, this is what I was trying to get. Uh, okay, come on. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Got the last one. There we go. Very nice. Can I sleep now? Nope. Okay. That That's fine. And finally, home sweet home. Ah, it's good to be back where it is semi-safe. I'm just gonna quickly go ahead and do this because uh, I don't want the cow going down there. Our pet cow. And uh, yeah. Yep. Early spring, day 86. And first thing that I want to try out is, can I do this? In combat. Yep, yeah, that, that makes sense. But look at this. I can actually carry my backpack, even though I have a chest plate on. That is huge. I absolutely love that. That is cool. Plus, it looks like you get an extra heart. Yep, you do. Okay, awesome. Well, I'm going to organize stuff, and then again, I will be right back. I believe I am ready. I have my armor, I have tools and everything. Everything seems good. Maybe I need a different or an, another sword, actually. Uh, also, because this is just a silver sword, I need to have... I don't remember the weapon that I've been recommended so many times. I keep forgetting. Uh, let me think. I'll actually go ahead and make a diamond saber. I'm pretty sure it's the saber that I've been recommended that is going to be the best weapon because it has damage absorption, 
chest damage bonus and sweep one, which I really like. So I'm going to make a diamond saber because we have attack 16. And I just hope that it's going to be a uh, dick speed uh, and attack speed. Plus 10% attack damage though. That actually is actually pretty good. I'll take that uh, over my silver sword. So actually overall, I'm pretty happy with that result. Now, however, before we go ahead and leave, there are a few other things that I want to make. For example, pretty sure that we can make a quiver. Yes, we can to store our arrows. So light arrow quiver, max capacity, four stacks, six stacks. Yeah, I mean, just one of these would be fine. So just an arrow, some string, leather and iron, it seems. So one iron, leather and string. I don't actually have any string, so we'll have to place some down and do this. And I think we should be able to make one. No, I apparently did not grab enough iron. There we go. And Iron Quiver. So that should hold four stacks. And I think we can yep, add it to there. And if we go into controls, I assume that we can do that. So press I and I can add stacks of arrows in there as well. Just like that. That is actually pretty cool. I don't have any of them in my inventory. And I can still see it. That is pretty cool, but apparently it doesn't pick up the arrows, but that is totally fine. I love that. I absolutely love that. I should also be able to make a tool belt. I assume it's this one from the from Bubble. Uh, well, it's a tool belt mod, mod, but it's made for the Bubble slot. So if I just go ahead and take this, did it require? Yes, require two string. I do have two string. So if I just take this, I don't know how this actually works. But let's see if I equip it here and then go into options, controls, tool, belt, swap tool, uh, tool, belt, cycle, left, cycle, right. So swap tool. Let's put that to something just for now. Ah, and then I can, I need to actually be able to access it though. Ah, so I can right click it and I can add my tools, I assume. I can then go ahead and equip it. And then here, I can equip this, I can swap it, I can insert it. That's actually pretty cool. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. I'm gonna keep that just to make the inventory even more nice and neat. Thank you for all those suggestions. I think it is time to sleep. Well, first I'm gonna pick up in the body slot. Oh, that's my quiver. Ah, so I either choose between quiver or backpack, I suppose. Well then, uh, well, I was actually, I, I do, I don't like having the encumbered over there anyway. So there was another thing that I have been told about, which is apparently crates that you can make, uh, requiring steel. But if you have crates, these should basically work just like shulker boxes. Question is, how do we get steel? Uh, looks like primarily from the steel alloy. Who would have thought? And then we just need Cincinite from the nether. And then we could make a crate. I'm gonna keep that there. That is not something that I'm going to do right now. Right now, I think I'm gonna sleep and then we're gonna head back to that battle tower. And then we're gonna defeat it. Well, we're gonna fight it and we're gonna do our best. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do and uh, maybe we'll get to the bottom and You know what I Nope, I saw a flying thing. I know it's not a dragon, but I saw a flying thing Hold on. Let me clear the area Yeah Please go away You're interrupting my peaceful area go away Okay, maybe we're fine Light problem, ladies and gentlemen. I can't seem to find my horse. Um, yeah, that, that could be a problem. He was apparently playing hide and seek. Would you look at that? Okay, all is good then. We are off. We have arrived at the battle tower. Now I'm not gonna engage it just yet. I'm going to put my horse into that house over there. I think that's the one or the other one that's 
beside it. And then I think I'm going to wait till night time because then I can sleep in the bed over here, which means if I die in the battle tower here, I don't have to walk all the way over. I will just spawn right in there. I'm gonna see if there's a bed in here. I think there will be. And we can also check out that tower over there, which looks very intriguing. Okay, yeah, definitely not sleeping in there, that's for sure. But yeah, there should be a bed inside this house over here, which will be perfect. Yes, there is indeed, and I can remove this to, to use Al, Al, to use to block. There we go, perfect. I'm gonna do that, and I'm actually gonna go over here and grab a bunch of blocks, so I have some building blocks, and then we can check out that tower. Unless the sun is going down and I can actually sleep, that we'll just sleep and deal with the battle tower first, I think. This is going down, but I think we can afford to have a little bit of a peek at this tower. We haven't really exceeded this point of the world yet. There's also another house over there that we would like to check out, I think. Um, but yeah, we haven't really gone past this point, so there could be other dragons in the nearby area as well. But let's just take a look at this, at least see if it is safe or if it is filled with bad guys, which it could very well be as well. There's definitely a staircase going up. Plenty of cobweb, which I don't find as an encouraging sign. And I would assume that there's a spawner in here. Nope, okay. Well then. There's another building over there. And, of course, the building that's just over there as well. It's hard to see from the sun rays. Pretty beautiful, though. Um, but other than that, looks like it is pretty empty. So I'm just going to drop down, like over here. Go to the bed, set my spawn, sleep. And then we're going to take on that battle tower and see how well we get on. Because we do have blazes in there. So that is going to make that very, very interesting. Setting a spawn point. And boom, we are ready to go, I hope anyway. But just before that, I, I know I keep saying just before, I just wanna quickly get this building over here checked out first, and then we'll go to the battle tower. Just because it is right here, I don't think there's anything interesting in here. Not even a single chest, just one ruined house, all right. Here we go to the battle tower. This is going to be interesting. I have a full stack of blocks. I have my shield. I have water. Don't really need the map on me. I do have the luck picks. I have this so I can deposit XP. I think we're ready. So we're just going to take it from the top and move downwards. Um, assuming I can actually get up there. Oh, there's a skeleton right there. And a spawner. And a skeleton spawner. Okay. What was that? We have blue flame. Die, please. All right. First hostile taken down. I'm gonna enter from this area over here, I think. Okay, you're a soup. This is not a good start. Oh, I can't see. Okay, so I can't look into. I can't look at it apparently, but it's dead now. There was a skeleton just before. Who has apparently seeked refuge, which makes sense. Who they're fighting each other. Oh, I forgot to make bandages. Oh, that's so bad. I actually forgot to make bandages. Okay, you're also very, very special. Hello. Okay. Yeah, I think it's a good idea to set my spawn point when I did. I didn't make any bandages. That's a big mistake. I need to retreat to do that. I definitely need to retreat so I can do that. <laughs> Didn't make bandages. A rookie mistake. I did just find this though on my way back. Back to make bandages. I don't trust that chest. Hmm. Looks fine. Well, uh, yeah. Fine, I suppose. Was expecting, kind of expecting iron, but... I guess that's fine. I just found something. I just found something right next to the fire. Very dangerous and I'm not healed, but I found this. A waystone. A waystone. We have actually found a waystone. So that means if something bad happens and my bed gets destroyed and I spawn somewhere else, I can find a waystone and I can teleport back here. That is a huge... I think that I think it works anyway. Current location. That's us. I, I think 
I think that's worked. I think that waystone actually works. Okay, I don't remember act actually like activating it or anything, but that is huge. That's a huge discovery right there. Wow. Here we go. Shear the sheep, get as much wool as possible. And I've just seen that there is apparently a way to get quite a lot of string if you go ahead and knife cut cobweb. That was a bit scary, buddy. I did not like that. But yeah, that should be a possibility. I don't know if you just use a knife just like you would cut cobweb using a sword, but we're gonna find out if I have a knife. I do have a flint knife. All right, Fantastic. so that's a cobweb. I don't think this is gonna work. Oh, one string. Yeah, that's not how you do that. All right, don't know how to do the flint, uh, the knife recipe thing, but there we go, a stack and six bandages plus 13 plasters, I'm pretty sure. Hopefully, it's going to do the trick. So now, finally, we can get on our way. And I left my horse right over here so that I wouldn't lose it again. You're... If I... Buddy, if I mount you while you're under there. Excuse me. I can't... Huh? That has to be a bug. Yep. A bug it was indeed. Just had to relaunch Minecraft. Or reload the world. Not relaunch. Reload the world. Cinderfall. Oh, not. Prepare to burn. Get home. Get home. Get home. Get home. Get home. Get home. Get home now. Get home. Horse. You go in here. Go in here. Uh... Lock this off. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Horse, you're staying right here. Uh, you know what? Maybe we won't make it to the battle tower today. <laughs> this has been my time back. Um, title of video. This is why our old craft is one of the hardest mod packs ever made or something like that yeah that sounds about right okay my shield was not equipped my head is very much hurt okay yeah you know what i i think i just need to get back home somehow i don't know how i mean i can probably Probably make a run for it, right? Maybe. Oh! Or not. Or not. Okay, that was the second one. Okay, bad idea, bad idea. Nope, nope, please let me go, please. Please let me go, please let me go, please let me go. Okay, that's a lot of them, that's a lot of them, that's a lot of them. No, let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go. Get it. Okay, that's okay. Okay. Cow, stay right there and don't move. Okay. Yeah, he broke it. He actually broke the door. What is that thing? Okay. Yeah, this is um. At least there's a there's a regen right here. Okay, and that's that too. Right, guys, this is my uh, return to our old craft, and it has been lovely. Uh, I know I have been saying that we're going to the battle tower the entire episode, but at this rate, uh. Yeah, the episode is going to be way too long before we actually get there. So we'll do it in the next episode. <laughs> now that we're actually prepared and hopefully we uh, get through uh, this tonight. So guys, I hope you have enjoyed this episode. Um, yeah, sorry we didn't get to the battle tower like I have been saying like five or seven times now. But uh, yeah. But yes, hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, enable those notifications so you don't miss the next episode. And I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day. And goodbye. See you next time.
Oh dear me. 